Hey everyone, we are back with another DIY compilation video. So as you all know, summer is approaching and honestly, we've had some pretty weird weather in Illinois. I am not going to lie. Um, I think this week alone, we had one wonderful, amazing hot day and then the very next day it was raining, it was cold and then it's just been cold ever since the rain hit and well I just all I'm trying to say is I cannot wait for warmer weather so all of you who live in the south mm, I wish I was there with you <laughs> but anyway we have this beautiful bee themed fabric as you can see we were cutting so mom aka miss nancy she was cutting the uh, different little beehives from the fabric the designs from the fabric she was cutting them out with her scissors now she's going to go ahead and take this um jute twine we're going to add a little dollop of glue right in the middle of this little uh planter and we're creating a handle and then we're going to go ahead and add some more glue around and then we're going to twirl our little jute twine into a circle we're just going to go ahead and glue it right on top so there you go <laughs> and once we are done gluing and adding our wonderful jute twine we're going to go ahead take some more jute twine connect it together forming a circle we're going to glue it to the planter itself then we're going to go ahead and start decoupaging these fabric pieces onto this bee themed home decor piece and as you can see we're adding some black so it kind of looks like a little just like a, like you're looking inside of a of a bee's home it's cute it's very adorable so as you can see we're adding the fabric designs here and I absolutely love the way it turned out and you guys will see all of the finished products at the end. But that was so easy and so cute. So if you guys do this, let us know because I mean, this is awesome. And uh, honestly, you can go so many different directions with that. But anyway. <laughs> Anyway, you guys, now we are on to DIY number two. As you can see, we have a clipboard. So, I mean, we've all seen these boring brown looking clipboards, but you can easily take them and transform them into something else. So let's do this together. So we have this Mod Podge. We're going to add our Mod Podge to the clipboard. A nice layer. Then we're going to go ahead and add some more bee themed fabric on top of this clipboard so now it's not so brown and boring but now it is it's beautiful it has a theme and of course we're going to go ahead and we have this handy cutting mat so we're going to go ahead and just cut off the edges you know the extra fabric that you can see sticking out from the um from the <laughs> from the clipboard oh my goodness i was getting tongue-tied you all so now we're gonna go ahead like i said cut off the extra pieces and you know with our exacto knife and we're gonna move on and go ahead and add some jute twine around so it's gonna have a nice little trim a nice frame around it and we're just gonna add it all around the clipboard so we're gonna glue that and we're gonna add a little uh twine bow to the corner here we're gonna add that and then we're gonna add some beads. Very cute. <music> Oh, oh, oh. 
right, you guys, now we're going to take this mason jar, add a blue flower, some blue flowers, excuse me, plural, inside of the mason jar. And by the way, this mason jar, we bought this at Dollar Tree. So if you all, you know, maybe you want to stop by your local Dollar Tree and check it out, see if you can find this adorable mason jar, because I love how it already has, you know, the twine design wrapped around it. I love it. It's very cute. So now we're going to go ahead and add some glue around the ring of the mason jar, around the opening, and we're going to glue it to this woven basket. And there you go. Now you can pretty much add whatever you want on top of it. Um, really just get creative with it and have a great time because this is your DIY and you're allowed to make it your own. So you all, these are the finished products. I absolutely love them they look amazing they're not only do they look amazing and cute and adorable but they were really easy to do and that is one of the i think one of the most essential things that it's not complicated it's very easy you can do this on the fly you can make it your own and you all i really genuinely hope you all enjoy today's compilation video and if you did don't forget to like subscribe and hey, maybe comment which one was your favorite. Anyway, you all, I will see you again next time.